Welcome back to Beal Science. You know, science doesn't stop during the holidays, and one of the things we do in chemistry to remind students that chemistry is all around us is we make these amazing ornaments. I want to show you how. We're going to start off with some galvanized iron. That's just iron that's coated with zinc. Now, it's got the zinc on the outside so that it doesn't rust if you use this outside. We're going to cut it up into small pieces so that we can make ornaments out of this. And we're going to completely cover it up with masking tape. This is going to go in an acid bath pretty soon, so we need to have it all the way covered up. So get it covered up really, really good and then press it down nice and firm. Now, next up, we need to draw something on there. I set a template on mine, but really you could just take out a knife and cut all the way through down into the metal, and then we're gonna peel away the tape everywhere that we want our ornament to change color. Anything exposed will no longer be shiny. Now we're gonna soak this in hydrochloric acid. I'm using six molar hydrochloric acid, but you could use three molar. Now, hydrochloric acid dissolves the zinc. Here, I'm gonna prove it. So I've got some hydrochloric acid in this test tube. I dropped some zinc in there and you can see the reaction that's going on. We have a replacement reaction and we're creating hydrogen gas. Now that hydrogen gas is combustible. Look at this. And when we light it on fire, well, we're just making water. Hydrogen combines with oxygen to make water. Back to my ornament. I've got it sitting in the acid bath. You can see it bubbling away as the zinc dissolves in the hydrochloric acid. Now the last thing is some copper nitrate solution. I'm gonna take that and I'm gonna spread it on all the areas that are exposed. And look, the copper is gonna break off of there and the copper is going to adhere to the top of my iron. And look what we've got. So hopefully you learned how science doesn't just end at the holidays and a little something about some interesting reactions and some interesting bonds and from my whole family here at Beale Science to yours, happy holidays. Hope, hope, hope.